One more follow-up question. Um, the U.S. Ambassador to Beijing, Nick Byrne, said over the weekend that the U.S.-China relationship is at its lowest moment since 1972, given the aggressive comments by China's defense minister on Taiwan. Um, is the is the president have any plans to speak with President Xi Jinping? Um, so let me just say this, since you asked a question about um, about China, the National Security Advisor, uh, Jake Sullivan, met today with Chinese Communist Party, Maltaboro member and director of the Office of the Foreign uh, Affairs Commission uh, in Luxembourg. The meeting was about four and a half hours long. Uh, this meeting, which followed their May 18th phone call, included candid, substantive, and productive discussion of a number of regional and global security issues, as well as key issues in U.S.-China relations. Uh, Sullivan uh, understood the importance of maintaining open lines of communication to manage competition between our two countries. To your question um, on a POTUS, uh, POTUS G meeting, uh, Nancy, interactions are planned at a range of officials across the U.S. government, but nothing to announce on POTUS G meeting at this time. As you know, uh, they last talked on the phone, as I just mentioned, on March 18th. We will continue to maintain open lines of communication with China. But what about even just a phone call? Not, not even I, I, I don't have anything to preview at this time. I mean, just building on Nancy, does the president want to talk to Xi Jinping by the end of the year? I, I just don't have anything to preview. As you know, and I said this moments ago, uh, leader to leader uh, conversations and communication is important to the president uh, as we deal with, uh, you know, uh, important issues across across the globe. I just don't have uh, anything for you right now. On 